Can't believe how cold it is out today. Let's see what we can get into with Life with Belsif's YouTube channel. How you doing today? Welcome to Life with Belsif. It's almost like winter's back again. Frig! So there's not much I can do outside right now. Except for roll lawn, that'd be decent. Not right now though. But, so you, just so you know, the Chevy Silverado has its new engine mount, its new inner and outer tie rod ends, new brake pads, because they were down so we get them done too. Forget to do the oil change though. But everything else is done. None of these mounts I got worked. So just so you know, late model 2007 and early model 2007 and up, different mounts. So I had to put a new one in it, which is good with me because in all friggin' honesty, I wanted a new mount in it anyway because I'm pulling the trailer and I don't like using used parts. Kind of cocks things over if you know what I'm saying. But hey, cheers. You gotta do what you gotta do. But at least that's done. Now just so you know, inner and outer tie rod ends didn't need changing. They were pretty good, but I threw the boxes out for the new stuff, so I figured I'd just put them in anyways. So I have a used set of inner and outer tie rods that are still mint now. <laughs> But what I found out is it's at the uh, steeler column comes out and into the actual rack and pinion. The boot ripped and it dried out and it's got a little bit of play in there and I think that's where my play is. So the only way to fix that is to buy another, yeah, forget it, it's good to go, Jim. So we're good to go there. Not really too worried about it, nothing's gonna fall out. Engine mount's good, engine's in there nice and solid now, so we're good to friggin' go, Captain. And all you do is washer and get a new grill for it because the grill's caught right over. Leave a comment down below and let me know what you think of this idea because I want to know, you got to tell me. Do you think I should paint this grill black or do you think I should get a new one? Because it's just, it's cocked. Like it's, the chrome's all falling off it in spots. Can you see that? Probably not, maybe. But it's just all cocked over. So I don't even feel like washing it when it looks like that, if you know what I mean. Jelly bean. Well, other than that, hey. Oh, I forgot, I got a new gift stick. Captain, for the old L Air, sure. You gotta put that sucker in. I forgot I bought one. I thought to myself the other day, uh, I thought to myself, God, I gotta get a new dipstick for the old LS sitting over there, but uh, turns out I already got one, Jim. So there you go, I'm head on one thing. It's better to be head on one thing than head on nothing. That's what I can say. Whether you agree with me or not, that's what I can say. Cap, break. So much to do, so little time. Leave your comments down below if you agree, why wouldn't you? Don't forget to subscribe and like too and hit that notification button. Hey, listen, I gotta have a serious talk right now. This is serious, okay? I need more views, Jim. And if you're watching this and you're not subscribed, you need to subscribe, Captain, because it would mean a lot to me if you just hit that subscribe button down there. I'm almost at 5,000 subscribers. Once I hit 5,000, the next goal is 10. So we should hit that by 2035. Just so you know, if you want, hit that subscribe button down there. I really appreciate it because it would mean a lot to me because I don't have a lot of haters. I have like maybe three or four, maybe five. So I like them guys so you can stick around too, if you know what I'm saying. How you doing? How you doing, whoever you are? Hopefully you're having a good day like me. But anyways, that was just a serious note on that please subscribe if you're watching this i'd appreciate it unless you're on your tv and you're seeing me and you're watching me i know it's kind of tricky to subscribe on the tvs but if you just take your remote and go down a notch just under where the play line is and just move over that way you can actually subscribe real easy you just click that go to there and bob's your uncle you can even like and dislike on that on your tv if you just scroll down and you go across you'll see a thumb up thumb down Go for the one that like this, so because I'd appreciate that one. I don't really care for that one too much, but who does? This one is still okay, but this one's better. So if you're on your TV, just scroll down. It's right there. If you go over to the channel or go over to the little dots there, you'll see it, and it's wonderful. But enough of that. I just wanted to give you a lesson with Dirty Old Bilson on how to work your TV, I guess, on that part there. You already know how to work your TV, but just in case you don't, now you do. Pick me up another scooter for Melanie. Got that scooter for, I traded it for GoPros. GoPro Hero 4s. I got rid of all my GoPro Hero 4s. So I'm only got the eight and the nine now because they're just sitting there collecting dust. So the old poor eight's gonna be the one for race cars that's gonna get the most use in the damage in the summertime. My nine is my selfie doodad. And that camera there, I don't use that grill too much unless it's, I'm getting a video that's further away from me and I can't quite zoom in real good, I'll use this grill, but 
mainly this one sits around and just looks pretty so glad i didn't spend any more money than what i spent on that camera because i wouldn't have used it but yeah i got the old uh Schwinn. Jeff traded me planes, trains, and boats online. He traded me for the GoPros for this Schwinn for the daughter because he doesn't want to ride it. It's not quite as big as mine, but it's perfect. Now I can tell Melanie not to use mine. The only problem is damn kids have been using both of them, her friend and her. So I put a stop to that. I said, nope, you had fun. You're done. I bought you that scooter for you, not for your friend. So use that. I know I sound grumpy, but hey, you can't buy stuff for your kids and have other kids wear it out. Melanie has multiple friends over here every week, you know. So you gotta put the you gotta put the foot down once in a while, you do. You gotta say, hey, listen, that's the way she is, boys. That's the way she is. Oh, I'm still eating my Tic Tacs, by the way. I forgot about them. There's two up there, and I forgot all about them. And I finally started eating them. You know who we are. I don't. I forget. I'm sorry. Stacy went to put this in her car the other day. <laughs> For washer fluid, I say, whoa, wait a minute, that's freaking antifreeze for the trailer there. I don't be putting that in your washer fluid, Captain. So she used up all my washer fluid, so I have none for mine now. Oh well. Frick, I should do an oil change on my truck. I really need to get that done, it's overdue. I gotta wait until I'm back to work because I'm not crawling under my truck. That's for damn sure. But I might go have some lunch here and slap this video up for you and see if you enjoy yourself. It is, uh, it's Tuesday today. Tomorrow we got an appointment and then we got a doctor's appointment. Thursday I got something, I can't remember what. Well, trains, boats, I got that stuff going on. But the boats channel, I'm good until in the middle of May. The train channel, I'm good until the end of the month. But other than that, I got nothing. Kind of just the last couple days been doing nothing, trying to save money, not burning gas in the truck. Got her fixed now, she's parked, Captain. But we'll get her out. We'll get her out and go rip, boys. Girls, peoples. Hopefully everybody's having a good day like I am. Not doing anything I ain't doing. Love y'all, I'm glad you're here. Thanks if you're here. Welcome any new subscribers, I love you guys. And uh, you know what to do for now.